what we use for diabetes is 0 0.3 milligrams. That's the approved dose. And part of, the, part of the approval was based upon the fact that in the other studies that we've looked at, retinal vascular occlusive disease and wet macular degeneration, higher doses of the medication seemed to yield better results, maybe one letter, two letters, but it was very consistent. And in diabetes, there was no real difference between 0.3 milligrams and 0 0.5 milligrams, and it was felt also the fact that they would be needing it in both eyes in many cases, so they wanted to reduce the, the total exposure.